Creating Space for Joy by Amy Rubin. Hi, I'm Amy Rubin, a counselor in Nova Scotia. And this segment is a little bit about the role of joy that can happen when we're in a session with someone. So sometimes people come to us because they're going through a life transition or they're having some realizations about themselves and their identity that that might be new for them or maybe something that they've known for a long time but haven't either haven't shared with people in their life or when they have shared it it hasn't gone quite the way they were hoping it would and so this is a unique opportunity to remember that while we are working with people who are going through issues that can be extremely challenging and they may be looking for um, some support and some strategies to deal to deal with these changes, there can also be room for some joy and celebration. So for myself, for example, I identify as someone who is in the LGBTQ community. And when someone comes to me and comes out to me, and it often feels like like it's a very important moment for them, it's there's something very beautiful and and special and often very tender in that moment. And of course, those are moments to be to be handled very carefully and you know to hear whether or not the person is experiencing some difficulty offering support. But I have to say that when someone comes to me and I am a person who they're letting know that they think that they they might have a sexuality or a gender identity that's outside of the cis hetero model, I often feel really excited. I feel that for myself, once I was out and once I was part of the community, there were so many things in my life that opened up. There were so many communities and doors that opened and so much richness of experience and support that wasn't there beforehand. And while it felt in many ways like it was frightening, there was so much to be celebrated as well. And I think that part of what can be a healing experience for a person is not only to be seen and heard, but also to be offered the point of view that whatever it is that they're wrestling with that maybe is hard for them to accept either personally or with the people in their life, that there's a whole world out there of people who will see them for the entirety of who they are and not only be okay with it, but be really excited about it. And it can be such a wonderful chapter in a person's life. And as counselors, we not only get to offer support for the difficult times, but we also get to offer the idea that transitions can be an incredible opportunity for celebration.